because it's always fun doing inappropriate things. from first ride in about three weeks. If you uh, want to ride your bike a lot, definitely don't start a bike company. The last few weeks has been uh, interesting to say the least. Uh, we've had a few ups and downs with a lot of work. We've got everything pretty much sorted out. A bit more normality. So um, out my bike in the sunshine, which was nice. Um, actually went out on a very, very early prototype of the palace. Good to remind yourself of where it's all come from. But for now, rehydrate, shower, dinner, get ready for another day. So I shall uh, yeah, see you in the morning. Afternoon, as I mentioned briefly yesterday, trying to get a bit of a new regime going really. This morning, not the greatest to start. The old... Uh, four-year-old Arabic keyboard, bit of dust. Everything worked apart from the return key, kind of fairly fundamental. So, had to brave blue water of all places. Gone through all the notes of planning thing with Kat yesterday. Got to create some kind of short and medium-term plans with that. When we've got new things coming, it's in the plan to tell you about them. Just to make sure everyone knows everything about what's going on, which is primarily what the videos are about. A couple of other things really. Just about to get some lunch before going out and meeting Scott from Caffeine for a little local ride. Um, we've been chatting about doing some video things. Regular viewers will know we will have we love good coffee here. Sometime this week I think Scott's gonna come over and do a little bit of a tutorial really on definitely on espresso, what the basics of how to get a good shot are. You don't have to be really really snobbish about coffee but when you get into something like bikes, why not kind of get into the details of it? So we're going to chat over that on a bike ride in an hour or so. Let me just uh, grab this, show you. Got a delivery, walk option on the lambs. But first, need to get a little bit of lunch together and get my stuff ready for a ride. Enough work, it's too nice a day not to go out, so I'm going to get some food. Get my kit ready. Go and meet Scott. Well, I'm late, but uh, Scott's later. It's good. Ice cream, Scott. Oh. Not a huge choice. It's either so, white magnum or, or sherry in the Ben Jerry. Yeah, make it a feast. Yeah, you take those, I'm gonna get a drink. Which Haribos? Haribo, feast, yeah. Coke. Cycling food. <laughs> Lovely. Right, so have on. you got any money? Yeah. Okay. You got some money? Yeah. Supplies. Got supplies. Yeah. Coke. Just the, the general, the fats and sugars are what, all you need in diet. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely got more than five a day of those. Scott just pointed out something. That red telephone box over there has got defibrillator written on it. iPhones are rubbish at zooming. 
a look at that. You must have to uh, phone, get a code. Brilliant idea. It's great. <laughs> had a nice ride there. It's been fun. Yes, it's been very nice. Oh. It never was good at curbs. That's a heavy hit. <laughs> I think you got away with it. It is. I'm going that way. You're going that way. Yep. Nice day. Good day. Nice ride. Good. Need to have a tidy up so I can get that door open. Too hot yesterday. Hottest day of the year yesterday, 35 degrees. In here, anyway. Airflow. Time to start the day. Morning. Oh, light again. Got the office all uh, a bit sorted this morning. Mentioned the other day that. We'd had another set of forks arrive, so... Raw carbon fork, ready to uh, fix the bike this morning and see what's going on. Grab uh, These should be 380mm axle to crown. Longer than a normal road fork, but not 400 mil like a cyclocross fork. So we were first developed this sort of thing for the pilgrims and this is what we're going to be using on the Mayhems. Definitely a road fork. Road with a little bit extra. So road plus if you like. I'm just fitting quick release skew where it would be. Axle to crown 380. Job done. It's just a very quick check. That 5 mil extra in length, overall length, gives you a little bit more height at the underside of the crown so you can fit a taller, wider tyre on. does mean you need a longer drop brake, but there are good ones around now. I guess the best thing to do now is to see what it fits on, or rather what fits in it. This is the wheel and tyre we've been using on the Layams. We've been testing it, Strada Bianchi 30C out. Battery's gone on the electric side of this but comes out at 31 anyway. So uh, there you have it. 30C, a good oh, what's that? Good five miller clearance. You could easily get a guard in there. 28 and guards not a problem. At some point I'm gonna play around with a cyclocross tire in there and see what we can actually fit. Because it's always fun doing inappropriate things. So coffee work until the good stuff later. Just remembered uh, one other thing before I start starting the email things. We've got a custom colour, custom one-off, custom painted palace to look at, so I need to get some photos of it, so uh, I'm going to do that now. thinking of doing something like this as a new paint colour so um, yeah let us know whether you like it. So, I'm going to uh, put this camera down because it's quite difficult to do in one hand so <laughs> Just 
finished all the photography of the new one-off uh, custom paint job we did on a palace. Um, we put it through with the pilgrims that were being done at the same time, painted it the teal of the pilgrims, original graphics on there, so we've got one-off 52 centimeter palace. Looking back at it, it looks really nice, it looks really good. It's definitely something we're thinking about for a future colourway, so let us know what you think about that. Yeah, just having a bit of a think, probably need another cup of coffee, but quite possibly Sign off now, um, crack on and get this done and get this out. Get some other stuff done as well, because flying to Taiwan, what's the date? On the Saturday, the 10th of September. New York and next week, the Lambs shooting that, riding my bike, having a couple of days off. They've got a week to fully prep for going to see the stainless factory, going to see the aluminium factory, talking to the carbon fork factory. Lots of stuff going on, lots of stuff to to sort out. If there's anything you guys want to know about, emails, social media, in the comments, the more you tell us the more we can show you what you want to see. I think that's pretty much it for this episode really. So I shall say see you next time. Thanks for watching the video and TTFN.